Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan, and welcome back to our Witcher 3 Blind series here on YouTube. It is episode 59, and I can't wait to get into the game today. In the last episode, we discovered, first off, uh, what happens to uh, a dwarf that gets mugged but didn't actually get mugged. We, we found out what happens with mugs. We also found out what happens with Sarah, the godling, and Kareen, and they're living happily ever after uh, together forever. Who's this? Who is this person? Who is this person? No? Okay. Uh, in today's episode, we're going to go into the bathhouse and talk to Siggy Reuven. Look now, I'm going to read this quest because it's been a couple days since I last was recording and, and saw this part. Thanks to the lovely Priscilla, Geralt now knew that Siri and I had struck a deal with Horson Jr., one of the big four bosses of the Novigrad underworld. It seemed a simple matter of finding Horson, having a chat, and getting out of him where to look for me. Where to look for me. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's weird. It's always weird to have it in Dandelion's voice. Okay, where to look for me. But in the Novigrad of the time, nothing was simple, and nothing was as it seemed. You see this old man? Not actually an old man. He's actually a hot prostitute. <clears throat> Never mind. Um, Let's see what the fuck's going on. Oh, this is dramatic lighting. Dramatic lighting. Let's use that good old Witcher sense just for funsies. Nothing? Okay. Let's knock on the door. Knock, knock, knock. Anybody Siggy. there? Open up. Oh, he's banging on the door. Trap door. Gonna open up beneath me. I'm gonna fall into a pit. No? Can I blast it open with Ard? What's oh, shit. The, boss? the bathhouse is closed. Need to talk to the owner. I know he's here. I'm not sure that matters, as he's terribly busy. Bunch of naked women in there? Bunch of naked men in there? What's happening? Busy with what? Busy with what? Entertaining important guests. It's prostitutes. In that case, tell him there's another one at the door. Geralt of Rivia. And I'm not leaving till I see him. <laughs> Very well. I shall try. Please wait. Weird laughs. Okay. Siggy Reuven cordially invites you to join him. I'm happen. You happen to be here? You happen to... Happen what? What do you happen? The meeting is in the baths. We will pass through the dressing room so you can... Oh, of course. Clothes. Let's go. Fucking crime bosses, man. Always got to meet you in weird places. Oh, God. Geralt does love a good bath. Your equipment will be safe. Happen the eunuch, huh? Happen the eunuch. Interesting. Uh, uh sure, sure. Uh -huh. The spider? Varys, is that you? Varys, is that you? Let's change. I'll get naked. Look at me. Look at me. Whew. Splendid. They steal my stuff, I'm gonna be pissed. In the next room. All right. I told you it was prostrate. I mean, lovely Hi, ladies. Nice bum, you have. nice bum I have? He doesn't blush. You can't even see my bum. Yo, hold up. You can't even see my bum. It's a courtesan. That's right. That's what you got to call it. A courtesan. Junior cut off his hand, then ordered them to shove oh. it the corpse's ass. And then he sent the body back, offering a hand extended in peace. Blech. Up the ass? I can't be the only one to ever make this joke. Geralt of Rivia is going to loot these plants. And where is he going to hide the plants? No idea, but excuse me, courtesan. Yep. Okay. Well, just, oh my God. Is this me? What the fuck? Can I sit beside this man? It's me with tattoos. And, uh, it's, it's, it's me except from Kmart. It's Walmart version of me. Oh, that was a, that's an odd angle. Sorry. Whoops. I'm sorry. I could go all day in here. Holy shit. You know who else could go all day in here? Uh, <clears throat> I, I just can't stop making jokes. I can't. Oh my god, it's it's budget me times two. Budget me minus pecs and abs and stuff. Holy shit. Everybody's got the same hair in here. Hi, ladies. Don't mind me, just... Oh, I was going to try and do a... I wanted to do a jump. Can I do a... Uh... Can I do a cannonball? 
clear that you've not seen Reuben. Seen Reuben's what? Uroboros. <laughs> Does it loop back on itself? I can think of so many dirty jokes, none of which are appropriate to say on YouTube.com. Okay. Yes. Uh, I'm supposed to follow you, I think. Through here? Okay. Let's go. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> what the fuck? Easy, Cleaver. All son Jr.'s a dead man. I'll have my scribe send you a notice. You don't have a scribe. And we'll eliminate Junior when, and only when, all of us say I. The person who walked past the, uh... Reuven, King of, your guest. King of Beggars, yeah? Reuven. And then the other third? Three out of the four? Is that what's happening here? Why the fuck you let him in here? Because I want to talk to him. This is Geralt of Rivia. Good to see you again. As always, I'm out of the swiving loop. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> uh, I'm a witcher. Let's let's treat him with some respect. You know, I don't want to walk out of here in a body bag. I don't want to be dragged out of here in a body bag. I'm not going to be walking out in a body bag no matter what. I'm a witcher. I'm a witcher. Problems with your plumbing? Nah, it's under control. Geralt's a friend from the old days. Although... Got intruders. Someone just snuck inside the bathhouse. Several men. What the fuck's he on about? Plowing fortune teller. Assassins! Please, no! Ah! This is where I run. No, just let me run. Bloody hell. I fucking knew it. You telling Any me the assassins had to way? also... Just a few. Had to also dress up? Sorry, dress down for the occasion? Alright, which one do I get? Give me the long one, the short one. I get the fucking... Blackjack looking thing? First ever body with my prick hanging out. Ah! I like that one. Cleveland, is that what his name was? Orson's henchman. Alright, come here, buddy. Oh, there's dead bodies everywhere. Holy shit. Oh, you fucker. Oh, buddy. I whiffed. Oh, there's three of them here. Holy shit. Can I set you guys on fire? I'd love to. Yup. Suck my... <clears throat> I don't have to say it. You can... Oh my god, this guy, this weapon is kind of crazy. Oh, I can't look at my inventory. What is this weapon? Just says steel? Get out of here. Get on the fucking ground. There's so many dead bodies here. I think I burned the wrong person there. Oh my god, look at those calves. Holy shit. Good work, gents. Good work, gents. My security failed. Terribly I'll get sorry. To the bottom of who, why, and how. They were whore son scum. That's the bottom of who and how right there. Don't start that again. Especially not in front of our This guests. is incredible. Seems the to be a right power struggle here. Attacked. Coincidence? Why do I doubt it? Let's give him a chance to explain. This is a bad time to tell you I'm here to see Horson. Don't believe I know your friends. Not gonna introduce me to your friends? Good thing happens not here. He tanned the hide on my ass for being so rude. Francis Bedlam you know, but then who's not heard of this patron of the fine arts and supporter of entrepreneurs of limited initial needs? <laughs> Support. <laughs> and the dwarfs Carlo Barres, <laughs> and also as Cleaver. Carlo's in entertainment, mostly. Is he okay? What was he doing? Was he sneezing? Was he snorting cocaine? What's what's happening? Gotta see Horson. Talk to him. I'm looking for Horson Jr. Interesting. What do you want with him? Uh, he's gonna help me find somebody. Junior's gonna help me find someone. Horson's not helped a soul in all his miserable life. I'll ask him nicely. I'll See, ask my Cleaver, fist against his face. Perhaps if you'd not called Junior an uncle fucker <laughs> and asked him nicely, he'd have showed up today. An uncle fucker, Gentlemen, huh? you out of your fucking minds. A chat session. Horse son's out to get us, and he'll succeed eventually. We've got to kill him These first. tattoos are incredible. So by all means, you sit here, soak, fart, and watch the bubbles rise. 
while I send my boys to Horse Sun's hidey holes. They'll make some noise, flush the bugger out. And you, geriatric, or whatever your plowing name is, want to find Horse Sun? Find me first. Cleaver, I like you. You and I are very similar. Very similar. Vasectomy and me go away. Vasectomy and geriatric? <laughs> Vasectomy and geriatric. I can't stop thinking about it. Okay. Uh, where will I find Junior? I hope I can find Junior before Cleaver does. Where will I find Junior? Any clue on Junior's whereabouts? Be grateful for any lead. Siggy, it's worth a try. Geralt's got a knack for finding people, and he's discreet, a value in itself. Leave you you are some then. ugly I'll, motherfuckers. Uh, looking on you, you know tomorrow, that? Francis. Finish our talk. God so damn. How about we get dressed? Sure, sure. Then we'll talk in private. What's, nobody's alive here. What a mess that was. Never thought I'd be glad to see the man responsible for my taking frequent baths. If you're any cleaner for it, gotta say it was worth breaking your ankle. It healed poorly. Can you believe it? I must soak it in hot water at least six times a day now. Failing that, it bloody pounds like the bells of Beauclair at dawn. Hmm. I had my reasons, or I'm sorry to hear that. I had my reasons. I had my reasons. He seems like You're the kind to fine if you hadn't gotten in my way. Respect that. I see. Well, I promise you that if I could go back in time, I'd do things quite differently on Thanet. For example, I'd have my men kill you instead of just tying you up. Listen, Reuven. No, Dijkstra. Just not in the mood for your code names, passwords, and other bullshit. I'm here on specific business. If you want to listen, listen. If not, I'd rather you spared me your wit and threw me out now. Ah, uh, what's the harm? Talk. Think Cleaver will find Horson? He might. He might not. But he'll burn down half the city trying. What waste. Leave him to it, I say. Work alone. Okay. Good Any to know. Ideas? Junior's got areas of the city where he's strong. Penetrate them, look around. But be discreet. None of this speed and fury and swinging your steel cock about. On the other hand, I could... Swing, swing around. Uh, okay. Intent on avoiding a war with Horson? Why? Or your colleagues aware of your past? Let's do the past thing first. Your partner's aware of your past? They know you're Sigismund Dijkstra, former head of Redanian intelligence. Mm. <laughs> Cleaver, Bedlam, and Junior. Well, I'd call them my partners if we'd built a mill to grind flour for the folk of nearby hamlets. But we just need to stay out of each other's ways agree from time to time that doesn't make us partners sure live and let live here live and let I live know who i am was bedlam sure the others most likely suspect but we just don't talk about it no need to i love this this clasp he's got at the top of his uh of his his shirt that holds it together it looks like a bull nose ring that's definitely how I'm thinking of this guy. Uh, sort of a bullish character. Intent on avoiding a war with Horson? Question mark. Why? Question mark. Pretty clear you and Bedlam don't want a war with Junior. Why? Let you me tell it? you what I told King Vizimir time and time again. War doesn't solve any problems. It breeds trouble. Trouble you then have to solve by other means. Make no mistake. Someone's behind Horson's actions. I'll not end him until I know who. Mm. See, here's the shit, though. He's got the bull ring, but Cleaver is the real bull of the group. A bull doesn't think, I'm not going to charge right now until I know what's actually behind the cape. A bull just fucking charges. Interesting. And head of intelligence, you know, this guy's a fox. This guy's a fox who looks a little bit like a bull. Uh, okay, Horson, what's he own and where is he strong? Hmm. Makes sense to ask around, I guess. Junior might be in hiding, but he's got to be collecting income. Couldn't afford to cut himself off. Gambling. That's his big earner. Junior controls the largest casino in town. I'll never forget. Hierarch Hemelfart raised all kinds of hallowed hell there once. Bugger bet and lost his ruby ring. 
Then there's the arena in the city's bowels. Betting scheme generates near as much as the casino. They're always looking for hired muscle there. Suppose you could always search Horson's house, though I doubt you'll find him there. Maybe some clue, though. I'd also probably tip him off that I'm looking for him if his house gets busted into. Uh, where's the house? Mentioned Horson's got a house. Where is it? Solid townhouse on Temple Isle, just on the other side of the bridge. Wouldn't wager me knickers on finding him there. Junior's not that stupid. Sure. Uh, how do I find the arena? Arena sounds promising. Where's that? Sewers beneath Gildorf. But you'll have to enter through the bits. Endure hey. the stench of poverty on the way. Now, Junior loves a good fight. Wager he'd give a lot to see a real witch Of course. Action. I keep thinking I'm hanging up my fists for the last time, but we just keep not hanging them up. Where's the casino? Where's Junior's casino? Near the Temple Watch Towers. Horson's got nought to do with a casino officially, so careful what you say. Try not to arouse any suspicions. Got nought to do with it. He's got nought to do with it. Uh, it's time I went to look for him. See if I can't find Horson at the casino or the arena. Might talk to Cleaver as well, though. Do what you will. Just be cautious. Horson's expecting payback, I've no doubt. Sure. Thanks for your help, Dijkstra. Just Dijkstra. go, Witcher. And Dijkstra. if you can't find the slimy bastard, come and see me. I know him well. Might figure something out. Cool. Oh, more, more options. Master Spy to Master Criminal. Interesting progression. From Master Spy to Master Criminal. Interesting progression. Why? Truth be told, they're awfully similar. Both about maintaining a net of informers, being tough in negotiations, bribing officials, the occasional assassination. <laughs> Same old shit. Yeah, except you used to do that in the name of some ideal. And now? Now I've decided I've slaved enough for ideals. It's time I worked for myself. And thus far, it's been going rather well. He doesn't strike me as the kind of person who... He strikes me as the kind of person who would work well underneath the umbrella of an ideal, but he's not like a, he's not a devoted, he's not devoted to, to an ideal. He's just like, yeah, if the ideal serves my purpose, sure. You're in contact with Radovid, question mark. Where are you in contact? You're in contact with Radovid? <laughs> See, you're as witty as ever. No, I'm not in contact with him. I prefer it remain that way. Never quite forgave you for conspiring with Philippa Eilhart? Radovid doesn't forgive. Not anything. Not anyone. And especially not the sorceress of the Lodge. Philippa was the... Okay. Is the sorceress of the Lodge? Okay. I, don't, I didn't really remember that name. I think we've met it before, but I didn't remember it. Any news of Philippa? Philippa Eilhart. Had any news? Just good. Meaning... After Radovid popped her eyes out, she disappeared without a trace. If I have any luck, she's finally eating dirt. Eating dirt. We were close. We were, until Philippa sent assassins after me. That tends to be how it goes, right? The people you'd really like to see suffer tend to be the people you were once close, close with, I feel like. <laughs> uh, okay, know what happened to Dandelion? Listen, Dandelion's missing. Any idea what might have happened to him? Same thing that happens to anyone who steps on Junior's toes. Meaning? He's surrounded by splendid virgins who ply him with sparkling wine and pastries uh -oh. stuffed with Nightingale's tongues. Come, Geralt, what do you think's happened to him? I reckon he's at the bottom of the pontar, trussed up with the strings of his own mandolin. Yikes. Loot. As far as I'm concerned, <laughs> he might as well be rotting down there with a goddamn trombone. <laughs> it's a loot. Why are you so irritable? Seem a bit prickly. Something bothering you? Sorry. I know I've been unbearable lately. But at my age, the menopause, what with hot flushes and violent mood swings? Dijkstra, men don't get menopause. You know that, don't you? Yes, you moron. <laughs> I also know you don't actually give a shite about my problems. What do you want? You I love Dijkstra. Need work. Thought you might throw some my way. 
Monster trouble, that sort of thing. Yeah. Might be able to help me, in fact. And if you did, why then I might be inclined to ask after Dandelion. Establish what happened to him. These goddamn quid pro quos, man. You'll uh, pay me on top of that, right? I'll get paid on top of that, right? Somebody's got to buy the Gwent cards. Free, yeah? Did you bargain this hard when Emma wanted to hire you? Uh, who told you that? Who told you? What do you mean, who? Emma did. I'm loving this conversation. <laughs> I could never reveal my sources to you or anyone else. It would be fucking unprofessional. But we've chatted enough. Yeah, I'll pay you. Count on it. So, can I count on you? Yes. You know what's lovely about that dialogue? He's menacing the whole time. But I'm pretty sure he doesn't say fucking until one time. I'm pretty sure he doesn't curse. Until the one time he curses, which is when you can tell something's kind of red hot to him, you know? Like something's real important. And that's about being unprofessional in this line of business. I love Deekster. He's written so well. God, the dialogue in this game is fucking incredible. That's how you can tell I love it, because I didn't I didn't say fucking until fucking incredible. Uh, okay. What do you need? Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll help you. What do you need? Maybe I can help. What do you need? I'd rather show than tell. Picture's worth a thousand words and all that tribe. Ah, and you do realize if you say anything about what you see here to anyone, it'll mean a razor between your ribs. Yikes. Figured as much. Excellent. One last request. Oh, let's call it what it is. A command. Don't draw your sword unless I ask you to. What the fuck? You got some you got some beastie here? In the fucking bath? What's heat what's heating the waters for these baths? You got some kind of weird fire druid thing down there? So kind as to follow me. Oh, his leg is fucked up, holy shit. Is this a is this a, a quest here, or am I just blindly following? I'm just blindly following. Oh, get away! The gangs of Novigrad. Oh, I just rolled a little bit. Okay. I think technically there are other. Nope. Okay, let's go. Is this sewers? What's going down here, Dijkstra? Oh, you can still jog with that ankle of yours? Holy shit. Just so long as you soak it six times a day? Oh, Bart. Not again. Bart. Bart. Oh, buddy. Bart, stop that. Now. Bart. Man. Bart makes Ziggy lose. Chorfin. Chorfin? Beating your head against the wall won't change that. Bart. Huh. Bart. Less thinky. But less thinky, but sadler. Where'd you get a troll? Holy shit, I got a fly flying around my room. What the fuck? Where'd you get a troll? Where'd you get the troll? From Zerikania. Won him. Card game with a camel merchant. Why'd you win him? jokes are getting better by the minute. See me smiling. I'm dead serious. But I... Dumpy horses. Hot Camels. Bear. Warm. Ziggy bad take. Good Ziggy. Troll buddy, you gotta get a bath. You're all kinds of dirty and fucked up. Why'd you bring me here? Don't seem to have trouble communicating with the troll. Why'd you bring me down here? Take note of that hole. We'll come back to it later. And see that door? Vault behind it until recently filled with Novigrad crowns and countless other valuables. But God, then boom! 
Chorfin go. I don't know what Chorfin is. Translating into common, someone fucking made up with nearly 20 tons of my gold and all the lighter stuff. And you will help me get it back. Who is it? Who did it? I'll help you. Can't take care of it yourself, though? Why don't you handle this? Gotta have connections in the underworld. What do you need a witcher for? <sighs> the gold mm. wasn't mine alone. See, I run a members-only savings club, a so bank good. initiated. For reasons that should be obvious, I prefer it if my temporary liquidity problems remained private. So I need an outsider. How do you know you can trust me? I don't. Counting on your survival instinct. Slip up, and I'll kill you. Lead you to Bart. Bart, sorry. Bart jumped that good. <laughs> What's lovely about the bank piece of plot here is that it would it would matter I would uh it would it would be less actually scary if it was just this dude's uh D Dijkstra's money himself if it was just like part of his fortune because the thing you always feel about rich people is like oh if they just lose a little money a little bit of money they're capable people they'll get it back themselves However, if a rich person goes in debt to power for people or lots of people or, or lots of powerful people in this situation, then they're in trouble. That's what's lovely about that. I'll help you, sure. Fine, I'll help you. My, my curiosity's exactly peaked. You're bursting with enthusiasm. Witcher mutations. They strip us of emotion. I'd be jumping for joy otherwise. All right, ought to look around. But first, some questions. I'm all ears. You have to have some idea who did this. What are we saying was the value? How much was it all worth? Got an approximate idea? Why the fuck do you care? Figuring your finder's fee. Don't get your hopes up. Know you too well for that. Just prefer to know what I'm looking for. Three crates of Nilfgaardian florins, a chest of emeralds, rubies and topazes, silver candlesticks and platters. I could go on. I got platters Shiny. and candlesticks. Chorfin. I find them all the time. Oh, God. Chorfin. So ch the Chorfin is the treasure? Chorfin. Any witnesses? Anyone see what happened? Other than Bart? No. And the vault's location is known only to the treasure's co-owners. Well, and the thieves. Could be the same people. upstairs? Anything unusual happened in the bathhouse the day of the break-in? No. Happen swears it was calm as ever. The usual customers, no incidents. Bloody bucolic. Thieves got in through the hole? Take it the thieves got in through the hole behind you. You're a regular fucking master <laughs> sleuth. Any other brilliant deductions you want confirmed? The year, maybe? Bloody name of Redania's king? I don't know Redania's no, king. But I am wondering, for instance, how that hole do. got there. Oh no. Boom. Hole. Bart, look, won't go. Bart, look, no. Only sleep. Bad shrooms. Bad shrooms, man. Fucking bad shrooms, man. Um, what do you mean by bad, bad shrooms, buddy? Bad mushrooms? What's that about? Pops mold. The spores are highly toxic. One whiff and you're dead. Unless you're a troll, that is. Yeah. Oh, so you'd be okay? Oh, shit. Bart. You meant Bart. Bart. Troll. Not talking Fuck on, to you, buddy. dimwit. <laughs> Where was I? Ah, mold spores. They cover the walls of the sewers other side of the vault. Actually thought it was a good thing, you know? A bit of extra protection. Thieves found a way through it. Bart, you see them? Bart, you huh. hole. Once see boom, got what? Breathe, shroom, sleep go, chorfun gone, bad troll. Bart's a bad troll. How now? You're all right, buddy. Stiff upper lip. You're fine. What's the boom? So he. When he got curious. Bart got curious. He got a he got a a single <clears throat> one one singular brain spell got 
brain cell got curious and sent a, a signal to another brain cell, and together they decided to go investigate, and then he passed out. Uh, what's the boom? Boom. Can you elaborate? Boom. Big. <laughs> Big. This like. I'll elaborate. Explosion. Big enough to blow that fucking hole in the wall, separating the vault from the sewers. Gotten pretty good at communicating with this troll. Lots of prior experience. Worked with idiots my whole life. You tried to track down the thieves? Try to track down the thief yourself? Of course. Hired this lummox, Fonts. Thick enough not to ask questions. We knocked back some pops antidote and entered the sewers. Soon after, I returned alone. What happened? Lad started belching something horrendous. I mean, burps with so much mass the walls shook. Told him, Fonz, stop. You're in the presence of a count. Well, former count, but still. And then he puked up. Up came most of the antidote. Lost his protection. Tried to pull him out. Then I heard a bubbling. Something crawled out of the water. Holy shit. I value the lives of my men. I do. But I value my own even more. Dropped fonts and ran like hell. That tracks. That tracks. What kind of something? Mind describing this something that crawled out of the water? No. Doesn't mean I can, though. Air in the sewers thick with spores. Can hardly see a thing down there. Must have noticed God, it's something. all Was interrelated. It? No. Didn't notice a fucking thing. Didn't do a taxonomic field analysis <laughs> either. I know it's an inconvenience to you, but I felt I should get the hell out of there as fast <laughs> as I could. I gotta look around the sewers. Should look around the sewers. <laughs> got any more of that pop's antidote? I've a few vials left. Got the formula too. Disgusting swill, to be honest, but it'll save your life here. Okay. Thanks. You've not pop's mold antidote. For, literally, you're no good to me if you suffocate. Listen, I'll be upstairs if you need me. Sight of this empty vault's giving me an ulcer. Good luck to you. Holy shit. Sheikstra, and we got Bart. Dandelion, what the hell have you gotten yourself into? Count Reuven's treasure. This is wild. Okay, well, it appears that our quest uh is going to involve investigating the side of the break in using your witcher senses sure 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 we got secondary quests here yeah from the start of this episode we've gotten gangs of novigrad talk to cleaver uh this is the other part and, and then we got an update on get junior the uh main quest there okay so here's the thing that's confusing me uh, we have, I believe, a something killing the sewers, right? Is it this one? Horrendous murders under the cover of darkness. Ah, uh, it just says this is the bits. Okay. Maybe I'm wrong here. I thought we had something going on with the sewers. Maybe we did and it just wasn't a quest. Um, it isn't any of these, yeah? Intimate the trader out. Mm, no, no. No, okay. Interesting. So, let's take a look at this, uh, this thing, too, so that we know what to... Let's take a look at this formula so that we know what to, uh, keep an eye out for. Should be here, right? Um, it was pop mold. Hold up, where is it? Pop mold antidote. Is it not a? Is it technically craft? And there's no way, right? Uh. Where is it? Is it just under food and drink? Which is here. Air Valus, um 
Pops mold antidote right here. Okay. That means that it would be under potions, I think. Yeah, it's under potions. Okay. So. That would have to be under alchemy, yeah? I do not see it. And I'm scrolling quick, but... I was thinking maybe we could keep an eye on what... Uh, what it would make sense for us to... Loot. Hey, Bart. Got a minute? But mm -hmm. we'll see. Let's talk to Bart. But no minute, God. <laughs> Bart rocks, God. <laughs> Talking rocks to Paul Blart, want? mall cop over here. Rocks want? Question I mark. Mean a minute to talk. You mean? <laughs> but nice. I know that Bart. One more time. Can we talk? Siggy, you like? Talk me with. Did you notice anything strange before the break-in? Anything suspicious happened before the robbery? Please. Subsicious. Subsicious. But no understand. Oh, Bart, you're a sweetie pie. Not, not a lot normal. going on. Something strange. Maybe behind those eyes. Felt. Heard something. Yeah. Yeah. Bart. Here. Uh, like uh, a piece. His. <laughs> That's the beautiful thing about onomatopoeia type sounds. Uh, they sound like what they are, so you can just say hiss, and I don't know what you mean. Hissing like a snake? What kind of hissing was it? Like a snake? No. Fumes? A, piece order. a bomb? Animal Probably a bomb. Right. So, like what? Like uh, rock? A hissing rock. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. With like a fuse and a and a light that was going towards the bomb. Uh where'd the hissing come from? The hissing. Where did it come from? But his here in lavatory. Lavatory? Where where but turdy dump. <laughs> Incredible where Bart turdy dump. Let's go. Where Bart turdy dump. Let's talk about something else. All right. Let's change the subject. Good. What the hell? But time got. Chorfun go. But God, now nothing. Don't be so hard on yourself, Bart. It could have happened to any of us. Why do you like Siggy so much? Siggy so much. Why do you like Siggy so Zijkstra. much? Siggy good. Siggy can't take part. He locked you up alone underground. <laughs> Don't get bored down here. Not much to do. When, but not much do. But think. Lots. All right, you gotta see a chiropractor, dude. Your shoulder's looking fucked up. Uh, what do you think about? What about, if you don't mind my asking? Rocks. <laughs> Rocks. Rocks, interesting. We talking geology? We talking bombs? What kind of what kind of rocks are we talking about here? So long, Bart. Uh, thanks for your help. So long. Mm. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. The thing is, it has been an actual pleasure, Bart. Talking to you has made my day. It's been fun. Oh, he's pissed. Oh, he's upset. All right. So what do we got in here? We had something to examine back there. Enhanced vampire oil. Sure, sure. As you will, as you will. Real quick, let's go this way. There's this hay, there's a hay bale there. Some dead shit here. That must be Bart's, I think I just stole Bart's florins. Bart, are you getting paid for your work? You really gotta, if you, you aren't getting paid, out. you should be. Something inside blew it wide open. Wall two. Hmm. Bathhouse drain pipes seem to converge here. Bomb in the bathroom. Ah, bomb in the lavatory. Hell yeah, dude. Alright, we should quick save right here, first off. Swamp mushrooms, a wire. That's great. Explosion crumpled it like a piece of paper. And there's mortar on the bars. So it was in place at the time of the explosion. Blast tore it from the wall. No traces oh. of magic. This was no Holy spell. shit, Geralt. It was a bomb. 
Now, why am I not finding pieces of it? Could be the current swept them away. Or it dissolves. I didn't mean to click that. Like Fuck. Of paper. And there's mortar on the bars. So it was in place at the time of the explosion. Blast tore it from the wall. Sorry, guys. Didn't mean to make you listen to that whole thing twice. Bits of pipe clear over here. Must have been one powerful blast. Yeah, I must have. Um, if Shouldn't I walk that way... Without taking that antidote. Yeah, that's what I was just about to suggest. Um... All right, here we go. I thought Witcher's potions were vile. The fuck's that sound? It's about to be some drowners. Oh, buddy, it's about to be some drowners. You think I can light them on fire? Drowners. Nothing flammable down here, it turns out. Okay. Here's what we do here. Nope, shit. Here's what we do here. We put a little bit of food on our hot bar. Uh, I'm going to put a Guinness on my hot bar. So that I can drink it and get that that effect of positive. Is there anything down here? No? Okay. Hello. Of a uh, health regen. We keep an eye on our antidote bar at the top. Yep. There's still lots of shit going on here. Any... Ah, yes, right here. Something right there. Hmm. Definitely came through here. What's that mean? Definitely came through here. I must have missed something. Oh, hello. Fine grading. Couldn't push much through that. Well, hold up, hold up, hold up. Fine grading probably couldn't push much through it's that? Pipe clear over here. Must have been one powerful blast. I thought the bomb came down and sat inside of it. Like, it doesn't need to go through. I thought it would just sit inside of the little... Oh my god, we are getting loot like crazy. Enhanced Thunderbolt? Are you shitting me? I'm clicking it super quickly. Uh, but it gives me the information afterwards anyways. Huh. Oh, there was something red right here. Another trinket. I don't know. I think I may have missed the... Now, why is there a trinket here? Doesn't say. Fuck. Or at least it didn't look like it. Um... Am I missing something there? The thug Dijkstra hired. Mm-hmm. It looks like I can set this guy's body on fire, maybe? Oh no, that was the icon for something else. Never mind. <laughs> it's like, why do they want me to light this guy's body on fire? They don't. Okay. We're doubling back so we can make sure and get everything. Looking for anything. Uh, any clues? We're finding... Dijkstra didn't mention anyone else. Must be one of Dandelion's crew. Vomit everywhere. Guess he had the antidote too. Keep it down in more than the other guy. Need to burn the corpses there. Otherwise, run out and try to stop comfy elsewhere. Yep, that makes sense. It did. It did want me to drown him, or to burn him. Sorry. All right, How fuckers. How long you gonna make me wait? How long you gonna make in me wait? Wind's howling. How long you gonna make me wait, you son of a bitch? Come on, one more hit. There we go. Okay. Dandelion's crew is down here. Okay. Um, let's look for anything. No, no, no. Around the edges. No, it doesn't go through there. There's something up around the... Uh... Can go through here. Oh, there is some right here. Hmm. Bottom of a container. Silver cylinder, most likely. Runes etched in the bottom. It's warped, probably by the explosion. Silver Bone cylinder. Bart. Must be. Smells like wyvern oil and caramel. Caramel? That'd be it down here. Time to see Dijkstra. That's it down here? Whoa. Oh, it doesn't look like I can make that jump. <laughs> Did you guys like my jump attempt there? Oh, I, what the fuck? I did make it. 
Oh, that was a much better jump. All right, first off, I loot all this shit for sure. He said that that's it down, uh, down here. However, um, I am gonna take free loot if there's or and or anything interesting up here. If it's if it's up here, that's locked. Sure. Okay, what an inch. Oh man, I did not expect to be doing this at the end of today's episode. This is crazy. Got a whole other direction. I can go through that. Nothing here. Gold coin. Trail ends here. Dandelion must have loaded the treasure onto a boat. Gold coin. Am I missing something? I just understood. What I'm seeing with the pearl in the ring is like dropped treasure. Oh my god. I thought it was like parts of the bomb and that didn't make any sense to me or like I'm dumb. Oh my god. It's parts of the treasure that were dropped along the way. Okay. Beautiful. Well, we chased it. Oh my god. Look at this yellow orange sky. Bear with me. Apparently my brain is uh, my brain is not processing at 100% today. Thanks so much for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. What a weird, incredible, twisting turn of events. Some of the greatest dialogue that I've I've enjoyed uh, in this game so far with uh, with Dijkstra. I can't say that very well. Dijkstra, Dijkstra. And then uh, some cool little some cool little wander a bathhouse scene. Oh my God, Chef's kisses. This was fun. I hope you enjoyed it too. If you did a like or a positive comment down below, or where if you really wanted to type a comment but you didn't know what to type you could type where bart turd dump and i would know what you mean i would know that you were calling this a, a shitty playthrough i mean where bart turd dump down in the comments i'll see you guys tomorrow until then bye bye